This is another splitting example, but in this occasion we're also doing recombination of the split beams. So we have a beam splitter, some mirrors, and another beam splitter that recombines the beam. And you can see that by tilting the mirror we introduce uh, interference between the two beams when they're recombined, and so we see these fringes. So here we're showing the fringes um, that you're seeing is a 2D plot, and over here uh, a slice through the fringes. Uh, here we're also just looking purely at the incoherent intensity. So if this wasn't a laser beam, uh, it was just incoherent light, you would just get this amount of uh, uh, lights. And when you look at the cross section here, you'd see you just get a flat. But because we're putting a laser beam through here, we can see interference between the two beams, giving rise to this fringe pattern. And again, this is one of the, the, the key strengths of non-sequential ray tracing, is that rays can be split and then recombined in whatever way is appropriate.